Hi everyone. Um, I wanted to apologize to you guys because I feel like I've been really inconsistent with you guys um, with my videos and all of that, what's new. Um, but I actually wanted to come out with a vlog video for you all about my trip uh, to India and Dubai, which I went all of February, which is why I didn't have any videos out. Um, but when I was editing through the footage, I noticed that a lot of it was just me talking to the camera and I didn't really want to give you that because I didn't feel it was very substantial kind of work and um, I didn't really want you to just see me talking to a camera because I did get um, sick a lot and I fell and I had to be in a cast for a bit and then I got cosmetic dentistry so I didn't really get a lot of like actual filming done uh, but if you guys still want it I'm more than happy to give it to you guys uh, I don't know um, you guys let me know um, so I wanted to give you guys a video nonetheless because I'm working on a transition video between winter and spring fashion and it's uh, taking a lot of time because I'm thinking of really cool editing stuff for you so um, in the meantime I thought I would come up with a little video and I didn't know what to give you guys because the vlog video was going to be the video but then it's not really that great so I was like you know what let's let's do this video let's do a get to know me tag because I've never done this video and people always ask me stuff about myself and I don't really like to do it on camera because it's kind of weird to talk about myself on camera so I was like you know what let's just do it because it's been a year and you guys don't really know much about me so uh, I mean minus the fact that I like to read and fashion stuff um, but I will give you guys some stuff about me so I'm just gonna read through these questions there's a lot I hope you guys stick around if you don't want to you're more than welcome to just not watch me or you guys could take pictures of all the times that I make a weird face because I notice I do that a lot in my videos and you guys can send them to me via email or Twitter or whatever I would love to see my ridiculous face anyways we're just gonna get to the questions what's my name Shruti um, it's spelled S-H-R-U-T-I not S-H-R-O-O-D-I or D-Y or any other ridiculous possible way of spelling it. I just say Shruti because that is a westernized way of saying my name. The original way of saying my name is something I will never say because I just don't want to. Moving on. Nicknames. Shru, Shrewberry, Shru, Tutti Fruity, Shruti with the big booty, um, Loops, Loopster, Loopy, just everything. Everything. Birthday, July 12th, 1989. Never forget it. I expect wishes. Just kidding. Place of birth, Bombay, um, India. I still call it Bombay, not Mumbai. Place of birth, I just did that, star sign, Cancer. Wow, I suck at talking videos. This is why I don't do talking videos. Star sign, Cancer, occupation, I'm not even going to get there. It's like too complicated. Uh, questions about my appearance. Hair color, I did re-ombre my hair. It's not super blonde, but all of the front parts, like all of right here from here to here is like my natural hair. Um, it is like a dark brown, um, and it looks lighter in the in the sunlight. Um, hair length, when it's not curly, uh, definitely past my boobs for sure, guarantee. Um, but I just did kind of trim it, so it's a little bit shorter. Um, eye color, dark, 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 super, super, super dark brown. Um, same thing with my hair, so if you go into the, the sunlight, my eyes look lighter as well. Uh, best feature, my hair, my eyes, and my lips. Um, definitely something that I always get complimented by, and I really like them. Uh, braces, never had braces, but I did just get cosmetic dentistry. Ding! And I'm very happy about that, something that I've always wanted, so it's exciting. Uh, piercings, I have one, two, three, six piercings, three in each ear. I have a tattoos and piercings video, you can check that out. Tattoos, well, I think I have a couple of tattoos. <laughs> Again, tattoos and piercings video, I'll link it here, you guys can check it out, it's kind of cool. Um, righty or lefty, righty. Oh, well, who was my first best friend? Um, I think her name was Catherine? And it was when I went to Singapore American School in like grade three. I, can't, I don't even remember. I was a really annoying person. I didn't have that many friends, to be honest. <laughs> Let's be real. Um, first award. Uh, my first award would probably be either 
I think it was a spelling bee or maybe something to do with like swimming because I was a competitive swimmer when I was young. Um, can't really remember, but yeah, I don't know. First sport, probably ballet when I was like seven and Bharatanatyam, which is Indian classical dance. And I did swimming too, but I mean, those aren't really, I mean, but dancing, I don't know. Those were my first three real sports. Uh, first real holiday, um, I guess, first real holiday would be, um, I don't, I don't know, I traveled a lot when I was young because my dad's a banker and so we moved like every three years, so I don't really know what my first real holiday was, um, but yeah, first real concert, um, Lincoln Park, um, it was like I think grade nine or ten I can't remember but I went with Karen Karen and Jessica I don't know if you guys watch my videos but I haven't talked to you guys in forever but I'm sure you remember that concert God, it was sweaty and disgusting and I hated it but the music was good but then after that I was like no more concerts and then my first real real fun concert was Mount Eden with Viv of course best concert ever um favorite film I don't watch that many movies I mean I do I just I'm not a movie person so I don't really have like a favorite film but I can watch certain movies over and over and over and over again so yeah favorite TV show friends obviously but uh, other favorite TV shows I guess the office parks and recreation just anything funny or um, what else walking dead homeland I mean Californication. I, I love HBO shows. I love Showtime shows. I love anything NBC related. I mean, just anything. But favorite TV show, Friends, by all time. Oh my god, that show. Favorite color, black. It's a color, people. Don't even get me started. But black, favorite color. Or red. Um, favorite song. I don't have a favorite song because I listen to too much music. I... I have new songs every single day that I listen to so I don't have a favorite song favorite restaurant um, don't have a favorite restaurant I love food I love any kind of food I am kind of a health freak but um, I generally eat anything I am a vegetarian though uh, not by choice but because of religion favorite store Zara duh or H&M um, favorite book I don't have a favorite book, but if there was a book that I would say resonated to me the most, by far, The Fault in Our Stars by John Green. I have a book review. It'll be right here. It is a fantastic novel, but it is one of those novels that while it is a beautiful book, you kind of have to really soak in what John Green's trying to say, and it's just lovely. Just check out the book review and read the book. It's wonderful. Favorite magazine, I have three, Harper's Bazaar, Women's Health, and InStyle. Just, I love healthy stuff, and I love fashion, so go figure. Uh, favorite shoes, I don't know. I, it depends on, I don't have a favorite pair, definitely not, but um, I obviously match it with my clothes. Currently feeling... A bit stuffy <laughs> and uh, hoping this video comes out that's how I feel single or taken single um, what am I eating I not eating anything right now but I did have lunch a while ago listening to I was listening to Baltech and Morgan Page's song captcha which is something that I'm kind of obsessed with right now uh, what am I thinking about? Hoping this video freaking comes out today. <laughs> what am I watching? Uh, myself? I was watching some YouTube videos earlier. Um, but yeah. And what am I wearing? I'm wearing a faux leather peplum top from H&M. It's one of my favorites. Um, and PJs because that's how I roll. You know, that's how we all roll here on YouTube land. Um, future. Do I want children? Honestly, <laughs> I've had this conversation with like all my friends. I think I would raise really crazy children. I think I would have crazy children. Um, just kind of like running around like reckless in the world. So I don't know if I want children because of that fact. I'm just kidding. I mean, 
obviously right not right now I don't think I'm ready for them for children for them <laughs> for children but maybe sometime in the future we'll see um do I want to get married <clears throat> let me first find a guy who actually can t you know manage the craziness that is me I am very crazy so let me first find a guy who will actually manage that <laughs> and then we'll see about getting married but I do maybe Careers in mind, I want to be a journalist, hands down. That's definitely something that I have a dream for forever. Where do I want to live? Oh, gosh, I don't know. I mean, I've lived in a lot of places in the world, so I don't really care where I live. I'm a mover. I can move anywhere and adapt, and I'm fine with it. So I don't really know where I want to move, precisely. But anyways, moving on. Do I believe in God? Um... Yes and no. I mean, it's one of those very touchy subjects that I don't really like to talk about. I I am a believer of some powerful force out there that protects us and helps guide us through our daily life, but I, I don't want to put a label on it and say, oh, that's, that force is God. I mean, I don't know what's out there and maybe it's God. I don't know. So I don't really want to talk about it. It's not really like my favorite topic to discuss. Uh, do I believe in miracles? Um, I don't know. Again, it's one of those things. I feel like you need to experience a miracle for you to believe in it. I, I know a lot of people in my life have experienced major miracles and they can definitely attest to the fact that they believe in it. I just haven't had a miracle hop like a miracle per se happen to me as of yet so I can't be like oh I believe in miracles or oh I don't believe in miracles they could happen I guess I don't know love at first sight no ghosts <sighs> oh dear ghosts um I don't believe in ghosts but maybe spirits like uh, I want to believe that there's something happening to us after we die but uh, I don't know it's one of those topics aliens uh again I don't know soulmates yes I believe in soulmates not necessarily ones that you fall in love with and get married to but I do believe that we all have soulmates whether they are um a boy or a girl or your sister or your brother or your mom or your dad or your best friend you have a soulmate um I learned this from a very very dear friend um that we all have soulmates and ever since I learned about that I kind of figured out who my soulmates were um, soulmates are people who teach you things, who have been in your life for a reason and are staying in your life for a reason. Sometimes they come and go, but they are people who are very important. So I definitely believe in soulmates. Heaven and hell. Well, if I believed in it, I would be going to hell. <laughs> um, just kidding. Uh, I don't know. I guess. Maybe. Can't really say anything about that. But anyways, kissing on the first date. Well, maybe you should take me on a date to find out if I kiss you on the first date. <gasps> I don't know. And then it says yourself. I don't know what yourself means, but I guess that's the end of this video. This is what happens when you ask me to do a talking video. I just, I'm so dumb. Um, anyways, I'm just gonna go. If you haven't watched my previous video, which is how to pair leather um, between your outfits, please do watch it. It's gonna be right here. Leather is definitely a scary material to wear, but it's fun and it's creative and you should pair it. It's, it's awesome. And I have some awesome news for you all. I am now a Sigma affiliate, something that I've always wanted. So, um, if you want to buy like brushes or makeup for all you ladies out there, if you want to get like a discount and stuff, you can obviously click on my link. I'll put it in the info bar below. It'll always be there in all my videos. So it's really cool. I've never been a Sigma affiliate. I feel so official. Um, and I'm, I'm doing some other collaborations in the future, so I won't reveal those right now, but it's really exciting and cool. And you'll be able to shop my outfits more easily, if that makes sense. And I'm reading... Three books. Give me a break. I'm reading three extremely large books, which I don't even know if I'll ever finish. <sighs> but the first is the the vacancy something. Oh, I forget the name of, book, of the book. But 
Uh, it's by J.K. Rowling, so I'm reading that on my Kindle. I'm reading the Game of Thrones series, and this is the first one, so <clears throat> give me a break. I'm loving it. It's awesome. It's so, so good. So I'm reading this, and then I'm reading this large, large novel called IQ84 by Haruki Murakami, and I've heard a lot of really crazy things about this book. It's supposed to be a rival to George Orwell's 1984, which I loved reading when I read it back in the day. So I'm excited to read this book. It's a thousand pages though. I mean, how does an author write for a thousand pages? I just... hats off to Haruki. Hats off. But anyways, so those are my books for you that I hopefully will get up ASAP. Um, and apart from that, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any other questions that you want to know about me, please do leave it in the description box below. I always respond to everything, obviously, because I only get like 10 comments. Psh, I'm just kidding. I love all you guys. Thank you for always sticking around with me. Subscribe, like the video, comment, and I will talk to you guys very soon. Have a wonderful week. Bye!